said unto them, Ye are the sons of the living God. And the place it was said, Ye are not my people. What place was it said that? It was said that here in America, in all from the earth. The Lord never named anyone Negroes, Mexicans, Panamanians, Guatemalans. He never named people North American Indians. The Lord never named people Jamaicans or Negroes or African Americans. The Lord never named people uh, uh, West Indians, Trinidadians, Haitians. <laughs> he says, in the place where it says you are not my people, because the Lord never called anyone Samoans or Hawaiians or Australians or Indians or Dominicans. So in your captivity, in the place where it was said, you are not God's people. Where did that happen here? Right here in the Americas and all over the world. What will be said to them? There it shall be said unto them. In that here. same land it shall be said to you. When the Spirit of God bring, brings forth the truth at the very end, in the latter days. It shall be said to these same people. What? Ye are the sons of the living God. You are actually the physical sons of the living God. You are from the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Revelation the seventh chapter. What is the importance of this? Now soon we're going to go into the Gentile breakdown. It's going to be coming very soon. So we're not going to leave anyone out. We're going to show the whole world, but it's important to identify those twelve tribes, those lost sheep, because Christ says he came for those lost sheep. What is the importance? Read Revelation 7 and 1. And after these things I saw four angels standing on the four corners of the earth, holding the four winds of the earth, that the wind should not blow on the earth, nor on the sea, nor on any tree. And I saw another angel ascending from the east, having the seal of the living God, and he cried with a loud voice to the four angels to whom it was given to hurt the earth and the sea, saying, Hurt not the earth, neither the sea, nor the trees, till we have sealed the servants of our God in their foreheads. So the Lord told him, don't hurt anything, told the angels. Don't destroy anything in this earth until I've sealed my servants. So it's important to identify these servants. Why? Read. And I heard the number of them which were sealed, and there were sealed an hundred and forty and four thousand of all the tribes of the children of Israel. So, so before Christ judged this earth, a hundred and forty-four thousand men of each tribe must be sealed. So it's important these people know who they are so they can step to the plate and assume their right positions as leaders on this earth. How do you know they're men? How do we know they're men? Hold it and get Ezekiel 9 and 4 talking about the mark. How do we know the 144,000 in Revelation that must be sealed are men? Ezekiel 9 and 4. 